So this is an HP laptop. It's a HP Pavilion DV6000 series. And specifically, it is a DV6929WM. Anyway, uh, I've been working on this for the past couple days. I uploaded a video of myself uh, starting it with an SSD. And all went fine until I decided to update the BIOS on it. So when I updated the BIOS, it flashed and it seemed like it went, it went through okay. And then it, uh, now it no longer turns, the screen no longer turns on at all. So I'll turn it on, you'll see I have it connected to power. And I've also attempted many things, uh, including removing the hard drive. I have a flash drive that I put a um, diagnostic that HP has on their website, 3-in-1 diagnostic. And that took uh, probably about an hour to put onto a flash drive, which was kind of surprising. Anyway, so what happens is uh, you go to turn it on and you get lights. You, you get acknowledgement that it's on. <laughs> All the lights turn on and then nothing, nothing on the screen. I've tried the Windows B key, the all four arrow keys, what HP says to do. None of that works. Uh, one thing I did notice is when I do press the Windows B button, um, the USB does not come up, but the SD card slot will turn blue like it's reading that. So, kind of, a, kind of at a loss here as to what to do. Anyway, uh, I'm not sure if this thing is dead or if I have no chance of fixing it, but, uh, yeah, very, very, very annoying. Anyway, if anyone else has had this issue, please let me know, because uh, this is just, it sucks. <laughs> Anyways, thanks for watching.